I'm really quite excited. Yes. And I look you want to do it. I want to do it with you also. Oh, I mean, is yeah. that what you wanted to say? You want to do it with me? I want to, you, do you want to do it with me? I mean, me? you're not my first option, but sure, Sam, we can go together. <laughs> what is up, guys? It's Wednesday, so that means we're halfway through the weekend. It's time for the good. <laughs> Go. And it's time for Samantha to be re employed. How do you feel not being here for three weeks? I just gave Das a chance to like shine in this show, you know. Oh wow, wow, the brand new superstar <laughs> YouTube. Oh my god, you're not a brand new superstar anymore. It's like been a I'm year. A year eh? old. Yeah, you too. You know who's the brand new superstar now? Bueno Chen Jin Hao. We're not the brand new superstar, but you know what else is brand new? What? <laughs> the good scoop this week. So you wanna find out more? <laughs> Moving on! Okay, so for the first piece of news, I think it's very apt because Christmas is coming. Yes. And broke bitches are still broke. There's this place called <laughs> Beauty Fresh, Fresh Online. They're having a warehouse sale. So there are more than 70 brands currently being on sale and it's up to 70% off. Do you know what brands there are on this list? This beauty. Yeah, yeah, Fresh I gotta read, but you must list the more. Atas kind. Gucci, Salvatore, Ferragamo, wow. L'Occitane. Actually, I don't even know how to pronounce it. Oh, L'Occitane. L'Occitane. I said, oh. everyone in the comments is gonna be like, oh my god. Uh, you cannot pronounce. Oh, they had one job. Just pronounce right, right. Yeah, don't. All these brands, right? That even after the 70% off, we are probably we like struggling to afford, like pulling money together. Yes. But if you think you missed the 11 11 sales and you're like, oh no, no more discount for the year and Christmas is coming, don't worry. You have this deal. And if you got a special someone, it's time to impress them. Just, you know, scratch off the, the 70% s- off. <laughs> yeah, then you just like leave the original price tag there, like, oh, yeah, I spent yeah, that much so money on you. A Gucci. So impress someone this Christmas. This is not sponsored, by the way. This is like legit good deal and cost by cheapos, okay? Yeah. Don't come for us, ah. Uh. Moving on! So, in the spirit of supporting small businesses and also Ryan's Rampage. Oh my gosh. So, dog shop Carisha's Wonderland actually reached out and she was like, Can I send you some matching apparel for like you and your dog? And not Sam. <laughs> what you want? I want. I want you to want be not, matching with you. You want a collar also, is it? No, I want this. Sam, that's some BDSM shit right there. But anyway, so what's really interesting about this company, right, is that it's like very Singaporean centric, you know? Yeah, like, I can see that. You see this one? Oh. <laughs> she just went like. Why am I gonna produce milk anymore, Sam? <laughs> Look at the beautiful design of the pocket. Which is what Bueno is also wearing right now, but his is more special. This is his name, just in yeah. case he gets lost. Then you'll be like, oh yeah, my dog is the one with the matching with me one with his name. But man, you know this is your name or not, but man. So they've also generously offered to give three fifty dollars store credit to y'all. So if you have a fur kit, you can buy matching clothes. Or if you just want to have matching collars <laughs> with your friends, yeah, I don't know. You can also <laughs> hit them up. So if you want to win this fifty dollars voucher from Dog Shop CW and get matching clothing with your fur kit, all you have to do is like and share this video, follow the good scoop, follow Dog Shop CW, and comment down below something nice for Bueno to read. Yes, Bueno will be reading every single one of the comments, right, Roman? Yes, Bueno. Say, say yes. Yes. Okay, so I think it's really interesting how they're like a small business and it started like husband and wife and then they have a pet dog and then they're like, okay, let's like start this business by ourselves. Mm. It's really very cute la, in I my know. opinion. And like because it's SG centric, you know. Yeah. It's all very relatable. And it's super unique because like you get to match with your, your child. Okay. Yeah. So um if you wanna win, do what she said and move on. Oh my god, so this one I'm really quite excited. Yes. And I look you want to do it. I wanna do it with you also. Oh, I mean, is yeah. that what you wanted to say? You wanna do it with me? I wanna you do you wanna do it I with me? I mean you're not my first option, but sure Sam, we can go together. Oh but <laughs> it's just because we went there recently and we sat in front of the world's largest waterfall, and by the way. Also because we probably can't afford <laughs> The main point is Changi Jewel, they are opening this glamping experience for $320 per night. So oh. what you get to do is they will like set up like the damn pretty tent, right? <gasps> then like y'all can like stare and then look at the what's that thing called? Like, the, Ooh, the rain vortex. And then on top of that, right, your ticket allows you to, you know the sky. Uh, yeah, 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 you can yeah, yeah. go that one also, eh? Oh my gosh, okay. So we might be going if we can pull enough money together. Yes, and now that you cannot leave Singapore to go and visit another waterfall, you can visit our fake but beautiful yeah. waterfall in Changi Airport. If we do go, we hope to see y'all there. Have fun glamping. Moving on. And now, guys, it's time for. What? Sam, are you crying? I feel very emotional because it's been so long and I cannot wait to sing it. <laughs> sing it together with us. It's time for. This is the Marathon of the Week. Yay! Wow. 
That was amazing. That was amazing from the audience. So I loud know. and clear. These two strangers, right? You know, Singapore has been raining so badly. Yeah. They protected a cat from heavy rain. Oh my god, babe. Yeah. That's so sweet. Wait, so how did it happen? I don't know. It just rained. I see like, how they protect oh. the cat la. Obviously, it just <laughs> rained like, like oh, damn. Okay, okay. They use two umbrellas. Oh wow, that's how they protect you. <laughs> Wow, oh my god, coming back to state the obvious, is it Sam? <laughs> okay, so basically, two cats were very cold because it was raining very heavily. Yeah. So they were all crouched up and then hiding yeah. by the pillar. And then two strangers, they walked past and they're like, no, we can't just leave them shivering and stuff. So they took out their umbrellas and then they made a little, <gasps> they made a glamping experience <gasps> for the cat. That's so nice. And the cats didn't even have to pay $320. <laughs> I saw one. Well, it's very nice of them. Yeah. But, you see, long story short, rain. Two people, two umbrellas, two cats. Wow. Thanks for that summary. Yeah. This is like the plot at the back of the book. Correct. Thank you for sheltering those cats. Moving on! One of the last few times you were here, right? Remember we talked about the hanging pork? Yes. I honestly don't understand what's up with Singaporeans and leaving raw pork out for the world. But Nicole, this is a sign, right, that the good school is doing well, that we are influential. Because they just want to hang pork, right, to get featured on our show, you know. Honestly, yeah, all you need to do is hang raw pork, right? You most probably get featured. That is so like I don't understand how like two occurrence of just like like people hanging pork. Okay, but this one very sweet lah. So basically, this Karanguni uncle, right? Yeah. He placed like a piece of raw pork on his corridor railing because he wanted to feed, feed the crows. <laughs> That's so sweet. But also, uncle is a bit unsanitary. So some neighbors mm -hmm. actually complained, and he wasn't like being a Karen about it. He actually apologized, and I think mm. his heart behind his actions is really very sweet lah. It's just legit to feed the crows, crows. with some good pork. Eh. the pork is the one still got cartilage on. Yeah, I saw. Yeah, see he give like atas quality like pork, you know, mm. for the crows. So um, thank you, uncle, for like your heart behind your actions. But yes. I think we need to stop hanging pork as a nation. We need yes. to stop just hanging raw pork everywhere, especially yes. in HDB flats. And if you want to be featured on the Go Scoop, just email in. Like your pork, <laughs> your pork. <laughs> Pictures of your park. <laughs> Moving on! Okay, this piece of news is extremely exciting and it might hurt your feelings just a little. <laughs> Why? Okay, can I just ask, how tall are you, Nicole? <laughs> 160. Do you know that this Pringles can is taller than you? Are you serious? Really? It's 161 cm and it's like never ending flow of Pringles. Like, can you imagine? Wait, is there Pringles inside? Yes! Oh my god. There is. So it really helps with this whole COVID-19 situation because right, when you want to share a snack, you don't have to like, hi, here you go. You can go like, hi, here you go with the entire Pringles. It's the same height as me, like a stack of Pringles as tall as me. It's insane. It's eh. not as tall as you. It's one <laughs> cm taller than you. How do you reach to the end? You, um, uh, wow. How? Then you must really like, you know, like you must like... Bazooka. Yeah. It's like a same distancing too. Here, the answer some of my Pringles. <laughs> so it was created on 11 11 right? And it was meant to like replace a boyfriend slash girlfriend because 11 11 is singles day. Oh. So the Jap Japanese were like, screw that shit. We don't need a man. We don't need a girl. We don't need any other gender. We're just gonna make Pringles. And we're gonna make Pringles taller than Nicole. <laughs> and that's what they did. And um, hi Japan, please ship some over to Singapore. I want to see it. Eh. I really want to see it in person. Yeah, physically, I want to stand next to it and take a photo. That's all. And then you can have it back Japan. And that is all guys for this week's Good Scoop. But anyway, if you want to win some cute apparels for you and your fur, ciao! <laughs> the instructions on how to win is down below. But wait, there's more. SOSD calendar. So because um, this whole episode is about loving animals and not hanging them on your void decks, we're gonna be giving away 2021 calendars from Save Our Street Dogs Singapore. Yes, and oh my god, so familiar the people inside. Yeah, oh my god, this girl looks so cute, babe. Oh my god, who is she? Who's that? Oh, yo, this one looks like a very old superstar from NOC. And this girl looks like she's five. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but anyway, so we actually collabed with Save Our Street Dogs Singapore and we made like a calendar of them. And the proceeds from this sale will go to Saving Our Street Dogs and providing this organisation with the necessary support they need to save them. Okay, so we'll be giving away five of these calendars and all you need to do is follow the good scoop, follow Save Our Street Dogs and comment down below what is your favourite month. <laughs> Calendar, we give you oh, calendar, yes, right? yeah, okay. And let's say, all saying girls, click, click here for more and click here to subscribe. I'm so happy eh, that we are in this together with all the dogs. But, Bruno, Bernard, look, your mama's holding another dog. Are you jealous? 
Are you jealous? Bye, man. It's for the greater good. Okay, I still love you the most.